Florida Governor and Republican presidential candidate Ron DeSantis expressed his concerns about the super PAC supporting his campaign in a recent interview, RadarOnline.com has learned. DeSantis told Real Clear Politics Philip Wegman, I don't have control of it, referring to the super PAC while acknowledging that this lack of control is problematic. It's just an independent group, and so the dynamics there are things that I just have no visibility into whatsoever, he noted. He emphasized that if he did have control, he would ensure it ran effectively and efficiently. DeSantis explained that the super PAC is an independent group, and therefore, he has no visibility into its operations or dynamics. This lack of insight into the workings of the super PAC has caused frustration and uncertainty for the governor. The situation surrounding the super PAC supporting DeSantis has drawn attention after the New York Times published an article detailing the internal conflicts and challenges faced by the organization. The article described the DeSantis campaign structure as unusual and unwieldy and highlighted issues with strategic coordination, miscommunications, and strategic miscalculations. The campaign's financial stability was also called into question due to excessive spending and lofty fundraising projections. Several key figures within the Super PAC have resigned in recent months, including former chief strategist Jeff Rowe, CEO Chris Jankowski, and Chairman Adam Laxalt. These departures have further compounded the issues faced by the organization. As a result of the internal turmoil, never back down, the original Super PAC has canceled all of its reserved ad space in Iowa and New Hampshire. This move has allowed the newly formed Fight Right PAC to take control of the advertising airwaves in these crucial early primary states. Chairman Scott Wagner expressed his enthusiasm for Fight Right's involvement and stated that Never Back Down remains focused on its core mission of running an advanced grassroots operation. Wagner emphasized their commitment to helping secure the GOP nomination for Governor DeSantis. The challenges faced by the Super PAC supporting DeSantis campaign are significant. The lack of control and the internal feuds have raised concerns about the effectiveness and cohesion of the organization. With the presidential race heating up, it is crucial for DeSantis to have a strong and well-coordinated campaign. The success of the Super PAC will play a vital role in ensuring DeSantis can secure the necessary support and momentum to compete in the upcoming primaries.